Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Mario Kart 64. So let's uh, jump right back into it. So I'm going to switch up our character now. Yep, going to be going with uh, Mario's brother Luigi. And we're going to be taking on the Flower Cup this time. And uh, Toad's Turnpike in particular has my favorite theme of the game. So I'm going to shut up and let you all enjoy it. What I tell you guys, the Mario Kart 8, 8 Remix wishes it could be this good. Seriously, I love this theme. Easily one of my favorite things in the entire series. I freaking love it so much. Despite the fact that's named after Toad, who I don't like a lot, but uh, I'm not going to talk about that because uh, he's behind me. He's not being a problem, so screw him. But uh, this is also, honestly one of my favorite tracks again. I mean, again, most of the tracks in this game are really solid and a lot of fun. I love this one. It's just so much fun. Let's see if I can get Bowser. Yep, got Bowser. Sweet. So I'm guessing Bowser and Toad are going to be my rivals this race, so that's cool, I guess. Means I get to hit Toad a lot, which is always satisfying. <laughs> but, uh, obviously the main gimmick here is you're going to be racing on a, uh, I don't know if it's supposed to be a highway or... Wait a minute. How, how is this even qualified as a road? There's no end in sight. Why are cars and trucks driving on here if there's no way to get off? That, this this game doesn't feel very realistic now, does it? But anyways, obviously the whole gimmick is you're going to be uh, avoiding cars and whatnot. And uh, my opinion, works well. It's pretty fun. Just uh, make sure you don't hit the cars and buses and whatnot. Because if you do, then you'll uh, get uh, shot up in the air for some reason and uh, lose a lot of valuable time and considering the uh, rubber band AI yeah you, you don't want that especially on higher speeds so we got Bowser again fantastic I was aiming for Toad but can't look behind me unfortunately oh well that's what it is let's see if we can't hit Toad real quick get out of here Toad come on yep it's someone but I don't think it was Toad. Oh well. Anyways, that was Toad's Turnpike. Pretty awesome course of ice or track. I keep saying course. It's technically a track, isn't it? Pretty awesome track. I love that track. The Mario Kart 8 version is pretty good too, but uh, music-wise, it can't be the original. Now we got Rap Bay Snowland. This is certainly an interesting one. So it's obviously snow theme, which is fitting concern it's uh, winter and all. So that's cool. Maybe you got a lot of snow where you're from, maybe you don't. Uh, we certainly haven't been getting a lot of snow over where I live, that's for sure, which is a shame because I love snow. So is my dog. We love going out and playing in the snow, but unfortunately we haven't had any. We've been getting lots of rain though. Gotta hate rain. Be careful around these snowmen though, because if you hit them, uh, then uh, you will fly up in the air and crash. Again, I don't know why this game's not very realistic after all. But uh, yeah, watch out for that. And uh, 
banana. Let's see what we're gonna do with this. Oh, messed up. Darn. I'm trying to get Bowser, but unfortunately, I don't know how to just ran to catch up to me. Well, I'd answer my own question. Or band AI. Red shell. That's good. So at least if one of them gets close to me or in front of me, I can take him out now, which is good. Oh, and I dare you. Pass me. See what happens. Mm. Yeah, boo, that's cool. Wonder if I should use that soon or should I just wait? I should just wait, I think. Just because Bowser's getting close. There we go. And we'll get a banana off the uh, boo. That's cool, I guess. That's one thing I will say about Mario Kart 64. The uh, items they give you is a little bit unbalanced, unlike Mario Kart 8, where if you're in first, you tend not to get, uh, you know, blue shells and stuff like that. For, well, obviously not blue shells, but you don't get, like, lightning bolts and whatnot. With Mario Kart 64, generally speaking, if you're in first, you'll still get, uh, you know, shells and all that, which is cool. So we get the triple shell, which admittedly I like. I, I like that. It, it makes it a little bit more fun, in my opinion. But, uh, yeah. It does lead to some problems, though, like, uh... No, I'm thinking Super Mario Kart, never mind. I was about to say, well, anyway, I'll just give it as an example. I was playing Super Mario Kart once, for example. I was in, like, fifth place, and I got a freaking banana. Meanwhile, the person who got me got a mushroom. It's like, what? I am balancing has always been a bit of a problem in Mario Kart, but I think Mario Kart handled it the best overall. I'm a Luigi, number one. Yes, yes, you are, Luigi. You are number one this time. Yoshi will always be my number one, but like I said at the start, I want to show off a bunch of different racers rather than just the same one over and over again. I feel that would get kind of boring for you guys, so let's mix it up a little bit. Now we come to Chucko Mountain. Oh boy, this one. I was never good at this one, but uh, let's see how I do. Hopefully I at least place in the top four, that'd be nice. I gotta admit though, this uh, mountain looks very, um, chocolatey. Hey, that's why it's called Choco Mountain. Uh, part of me just wants to jump off my car and eat the, eat the mountain now. I love chocolate, after all. Chocolate is delicious, gosh darn it, I love it. That looks like grounded up chocolate there, like you put in like a hot chocolate or something like that. What the heck? Oh my goodness! Falling rocks, oh boy. Yeah, I gotta be careful of that. Okay, that was awesome. <laughs> Unintentionally awesome, but I will gladly take it. But we got a problem now, I got a green shell spinning around me. Gee, I, I wish I could throw it behind me. Unfortunately though, I can't. But one of these two will get close to me eventually, I'm sure I can hit him with it. Hopefully. There we go. Thank you, Bowser. Thank you, Toad. Oh, always satisfying to see Toad spin out like that. If you're new here, I really hate Toad, just an FYI. Alright, anyways. Yeah, she's actually in the top four. Good for you, buddy. I don't, I don't know if it'll last, but I can hope so. Oh, crap, I got flattened. Yep, got flattened. That sucks. I don't know why you're saying here we go after getting flattened, Luigi. That's a little weird. Like, oh no, I just got the flattened. Oh well, here we go. Yeah, red shell, don't fail me. It failed me. Oh crap. Yep, we're definitely not catching up at this rate. That's not good. Man, get a star if I'm lucky. Red shell, do not fail me again. All right, did not fail me. Good. That's more like it. All right, there you are, you little. Mm. Not gonna say it. This is a family-friendly LP after all. It's an E-rated game. Oh yeah, star. Yes. See what I mean? In Mario Kart 8, if you're in second place, you never get a star. But here, you can still get a star, which is pretty awesome if you ask me. I like that. I like Mario Kart 8. Don't get me wrong; it's still my favorite one. But at the same time, I do think uh, item distribution could have been a little better in that game. But anyways, that's Shaco Mountain. Thank goodness for that star, otherwise I might not have gotten first. Alright. One more race to go. Can you feel the finality of this cup? We still got two more cups to go, so obviously it's not the end of the LP, but you know what I mean. 
And we end on Mario Raceway. So we played the Ouija Raceway, now it's time for Mario Raceway. Huh, maybe I should have switched the order around so that Mario Race is on Mario Raceway and Luigi Race is on the Ouija Raceway. But then again, this is, if this is Mario Raceway, why does, uh, why does Yoshi have two sides here? Why does Koopa have two sides? Koopa Air, Mario Star... Interesting. Eh, not the case. See ya, Bowser. Don't catch you back up! But I know you will because you are rubber band to me and it all sucks. And so with a toad, we're well, freaking that sucks. I do not like you a toad at all. Well, then again, Luigi probably does like the most toads in uh, the Mushroom Kingdom, so why am I, why am I trying to claim he does? And I don't know. I just don't know. Well, then again, we are in the race right now, so he probably doesn't like anybody at all. all right down to one green shell, so let's go and switch out with my red ones. There we go. Yeah, it was, well, it was up the Koopa Shell Shield, as I always like to call it. So good for uh, blocking up com upcoming uh, projectiles and whatnot. Like someone tries to throw a red shell at me, boom, my shell just absorbs it for me. I love that. Wait, what? Mario's in second? Okay, there's Toad. He's finally catching back up. Yep, I knew it was going to happen eventually. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Oh, Toad's gone again. Yes, good. Give him away. I don't want him getting on the pedestal. Ah, he's back in. Ugh. Yeah, can't have everything, unfortunately. And the only saving grace here is that I get to hit him with more items, so that's good. Oh, well, thank goodness for my shells. They protect me from that. And... Got to drop one last banana on Toad, so that's always a plus. And hey, Yoshi got in the top four this time. Good for you, pal. Alright, so that's the end of the Flower Cup. So let's watch the award ceremony, and that'll be the end of this part. Yep, another, another easy victory. Thank goodness. Again, I might have been able to do this on a hard CC, but, uh, yeah, probably not with everybody that I wanted to play as, because, uh, Spoiler alert, Mario, Luigi, and the character I'll be playing as next. Generally not very good with them. Just just saying. I, I generally, whenever I play this game by myself, I always play as Yoshi, so... Go figure, I'm good with Yoshi, but not everybody else. But I want to show off more characters, so... That's why I chose to do it this way. Get that piece of crap off my pedestal, seriously. And why is the villain up here? Get him out of here, too. I'm a Luigi, I'm a number one, and I don't want these losers next to me. I don't want to catch their illusionists. Could you imagine if Luigi actually said that? That'd be funny. <laughs> Anyways, same trophy. Not like Mario Kart where they changed up, but oh well, that's fine. It's all good. Indeed you are, Luigi. Indeed you are. Anyways, folks, that's going to do it for me, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later.